Well, Matt, you're the one who saved Ulrika's life, aren't you? She told me all about it. It was a very brave thing you did. I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. Here, consider this a small token of my gratitude. Now, tell me, are you registered? Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized training, which comes in very useful when pursuing a vacation. Well, now, that won't do. You need only speak with the innkeeper to register. Go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, mayhap I can advise you. Tis a vacation for those who seek to master the sword and shield. Fighters favor a balanced approach, excelling in both offense and defense, and can adapt to any situation. I am a fighter myself. And should there come a time when you impress me with your prowess, I might be willing to impart unto you some of what I know. Naturally, it is a vocation for those who seek to master the bow, an exceptionally useful long-ranged weapon. At close range, however, a bow is nary more useful than a walking stick. Aye, the secret to being a successful archer is maintaining distance between you and your foes. It is a vocation for those who seek to master the mystical arts. Magic. Mages can cast a wide array of offensive spells and aid their allies with magical support. However, the more powerful the spell, the longer thus a mage is unlikely to last long on the field of battle without allies to protect them. It is a vocation for those who seek to master the dagger. Such blades lack heft, though this grants them the advantage of speed. Thieves favor light armor, which leaves them more vulnerable to attacks than those of other vocations. Their talents depend upon their finesse and ability to compensate for the length of their blade through sheer agility. Should you dedicate yourself to a vocation, you will find that new paths to master will open up to you over time. Try them as you like. Very well. There is no wrong choice in any case. It is entirely up to you which vocation you adopt. But I shan't take up any more of your time. Pray be well. Where to now? Here at the inn, we also offer changes of vocation for those who seek it. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me.